Come back. I'll gladly kill you myself. Yeah, Eric. You're gonna get killed if you don't watch out. Somehow we have to avoid all these rocks. Eric, watch out. Uh, see, protecting you, I died. Come on, come on. Where are you? Get down. Ah! <laughs> 
Get down here. Come on. Watch out, Eric. Don't stand out there in the open like that. Coming for you someday. You cannot prevail against me. I will see. You, mortal. After this fight, I think my courage is picking up. Is everybody alive? Eric, you made it this time. Karjo, where are you? You ran away again, didn't you? Where's Karjo? Good day, friend. Keeping well? Lot Kongrach. You truly have the voice of a Dover. Alduin's allies will think twice after this victory. It wasn't really a victory since Alduin escaped. I need to find out where he went. Nilivrach in Moro. True, this is not the final Krongra victory, but. Not even the heroes of old were able to defeat Alduin in open battle. Alduin always was Pahlok, arrogant in his power. Uznagar Par, he took domination as his birthright. This should shake the loyalty of the Dove who serve him. I hope so. All right, I need to find out where he went. How do I do that? Yes, one of his allies could tell us. Mat Mahus. But it will not be so easy to convince one of them to betray him. Perhaps hmm. the Hafkasayun, the palace in Whiterun, Dragon's Reach. It was originally built to house a captive Dova. A fine oh, really? place to trap one of Alduin's allies, hmm? The Greybeard should have told me that. Hmm, that's an interesting fact. You mean he can be trapped right up there in the top of Dragon's Reach? The Yarl White might not think this is such a good idea. Hmm, yes. But your Soom is strong. I do not doubt that you can convince him of the need. I wish to meditate on a word. Which calls to you, Dovakin? Fus, Faim, or Yol? Well, how about all three? What are they? It is called force in your tongue. But as you push the world, so does the world push back. Think of the way force may be applied effortlessly. Imagine but a whisper pushing aside all in its path. Hmm. That is Fus. Let its meaning fill you. Sum Ark Mora, you will push the world harder than it pushes back. That sounds like, almost like what I used to push away the magic storm in order to climb up on up the mountain to here. Uh, alright, I wish to meditate on one of the other words. Which calls to you, Dovakin? 
Foos, Fime, or Yol. Well, since I got Foos, we'll go with Fime. Fade in your tongue. Mortals have greater affinity for this world than the dove. Stay put. Everything mortal fades away in time, but the spirit remains. So I push something and then Ponder fade the something? Ponder the meaning of spirit, Unslad Zee. Where mortal flesh may wither and die, the spirit endures. That is fine. Let that meaning fill you, Sum Ark Mora. Spirit. You will find that your spirit will give you more strength. So I won't have to shout to push something away. It will be in my spirit. I'll think it with my spirit and it'll push something away. Hmm. Alright, what's the next one? Which calls to you, Dovahkiin? Fus, Fim, or Yol? Yol. I push something within my spirit. Now what? In your tongue, the word simply means fire. It is Ooh. change given form, power at its most primal. That is the true meaning of Yol. Solyek, power. You have it, as do all Dove. But power is inert without action and choice. Think of this as the fire builds in your sum, in your breath. Sum Ark Mora. What will you burn? What will you spare? Wow, very cool. The fire within I have just got. You mean I can breathe out fire like a dragon? Holy cow. This dragonborn crap is getting more and more interesting. <laughs> While it's getting more and more terrifying, to tell you the truth. All right. Yes. This was ages ago, you understand. There were more of us then. Before the Bruniki, the Akaviri came and killed all my Zema. I used to visit him from time to time, nearly crazed by loneliness and captivity. Tiraz Sivaz. He did not even remember his own name. What a pitiful fate. I do not know how he came to be caught, but the Bronyun, the Jarl, was very proud of his pet. And he just kept <sighs> him trapped up in there? The Hofkasayun has been known as Dragon's Reach ever since. Okay, what else? Um, yes, this was ages oh, ago. Oh, all right, you all right. Understand. You don't have any more to tell me. Were well, more of us then? Before the Bruniki, the Akaviri came and killed all my Zema. All right, so I suppose I have to go talk to Jarl, right? I want, a, I want a picture with you. Hi, guys. Uh -huh, there you are, Carjo. You ran away, didn't you? I know you did. I wonder if I can get a better one than that. I want the sun on my face. Ooh, that's pretty cool. All right. I shall leave you, Parthenax, and I shall go. Talk to the Jarl. Come on, man. We got a job to do.
Oh, and good morning, grandkids. Sorry, I was really, really busy when you all showed up. Uh, now we have to go talk to the Jarl. This battle is over. <sighs> yeah, I died a couple of times. But it's done. Now we've got to go find out how to trap a dragon. So, good morning, grandkids. And goodbye, grandkids. <laughs> this is a good stopping point for this, even though it's a little short. So, we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.